Hello there, it's me, Rama, and I'm now demonstrating platforming in physics multiplayer-based game. Now, I want to prove I'm using 200 millisecond lag. If you notice, when I jump, there's a bit of a delay before the other screen jumps. Right? The client's jumping, and there's a delay. So they don't land at the same time, and they're delayed by about 200 millisecond. Maybe more like 0.4, depending. So that setting is actually checked off but now watch this this is physics place multiplayer platformer game and then they fall again I'm in an actual multiplayer testing environment here now the hardest case oh and because I'm still capturing movement input, even though I have to turn the interpolation off as you see from that little message, I can actually move around while I'm on the platform. So, let's see that again. So I turn interpolation off because otherwise the unit falls through the platform, but I can still move around because I'm still capturing player input. This is with a totally custom pawn. I'm not using any UV4 replication code from the character class. It's all my own replication code. And then watch jump. That's the hardest case right there, jumping from one moving thing <laughs> to, to another object. Oh. Jump. And it replicates. So again, 200 millisecond lag. There's that delay, see it? My simulated network environment. And this is how well it's working using my hybrid solution. Oh, so good. One more time. And jump. Yay! It works! <laughs> let see if I can push this guy off. Go, go, come on, let's go. Oh. <laughs> Have a nice day.